All right, guys. Uh, today we're going to try uh, Chapman's Enderman Farm. Uh, he's got a great video on how to do it. Uh, I've never done one before, so it should be pretty funny to watch. I'm gonna attempt to do it without the pumpkin head. Uh, so we don't have a bad view. I think I have everything I need. Got our uh, trapdoors, planks, hoppers. Uh, you just need one minecart and one rail. I'm just bringing an extra just in case. A couple buckets of water, some chests to collect things. A few building blocks. Uh, you don't have to build any, but we're just gonna get rid of a little bit of that yellow rock that I'm not a big fan of. Um, I'm gonna bring some ladders. He just flies around the whole time. I don't have wings. So we're gonna bring some ladders. Um, you only need uh, nine, maybe 18 leaves, depending on uh, if you're going to do the expansion or not, but um, we're just going to go ahead and bring a stack, so we've got plenty. Um, you only need one name tag for the base version, we're going to bring three. Um, that kind of depends on how big your island is you build on, if you need to add little extra platforms for the endermites. So that way it keeps on going to the ocean if we take a little turn here. That's how we get to the end. Like I said, not super far. A lot faster than running there in the overworld, that's for sure. And we're going to sit right here in this little side room that was unoccupied, so I kind of took it over. A line of torches should take us right to our. And there's a portal. Ah, nice thought I've not collected my dragon egg. We should do that this time. Um, did I just destroy that? I did, didn't I? I thought you still touched it. I don't know. I should have checked on that before I did it. Oh well. Build around this. One extra block in here with this. Don't want the cart to end up, so that way it will end up there. Uh, let's see, we need to get. Oh, I did not put a name on these name tags. Yep, I'm prepared. Don't worry. Just name those stupid dolphins too, you'd think I would remember. So we'll have. We'll have Mighty Might. That'll be fun. I have 10. 10 pearls on me. Uh, we want to have this ready. We want to have this ready. Hopefully, those 10 pearls are enough. Uh, the rest of them I had turned into eyes, so. Not. We'll have to farm some more here. We got plenty of candidates. Um, so you just chunk this down, and you will take some damage. But eventually, you should get an endermite. You have to take a quick snack. stack of stone with you. Let's see, I think I have a platform around here already.
second thought, we are going to go ahead and make that just a hair taller. So, we're gonna put our, so you will take damage from the um, Endermite when it forms here as well. So, oh, oh, like that. So, uh, I was going to say that you want to be, <laughs> have your health up, uh, which I did not, so, you might, you might, yeah, I mean, I need you, buddy. There he is. Hey, buddy. All right, mighty mate. There we go. Flawless. I'm just like I knew what I was doing. All right, so now we're actually gonna leave him. That's the wrong direction. Uh, we can take this top edge off. Uh, we're gonna leave that bottom edge for now because. Oh, we kind of. I want to flatten this off a bit too. I don't know how important that stuff is. We need to at least fill in. Oh, oh, there's my egg. Why do you keep moving, egg? So we need a <coughs> clean. this off here later but we're basically going to take some of this and fill in that rough side so that our endermen are not getting tripped up um, when they come running for this little guy. The idea here is for whatever reason endermen come running when there's an endermite visible right now he's not visible so he's not attracting anything we're gonna flood around this column here and that will keep the Enderman from running into that portal. So if you're doing it here, you want to leave one space and then clean out a 3x3. Three three. That's going to be our hole. Uh, if you're doing it anywhere else, you want one, two, three, four. Nope, just kidding. You want five spots. Your fourth Oh, five spots. This one is where your bushes go. So you want a three by three bushes. And you want trapdoors there, uh, trapdoors there, and that makes the Enderman think. Uh, that they are safe. So, then we'll have a little killing area right down here. Anyway, now you do want to be careful um, digging down here. I do have my ladders on me because um, I don't have any wings or rockets, and uh, 
I don't really know how long this island is, or how deep this island is, so uh, we are going to dig slowly. properly this is where we're gonna have our room and again you want to make sure you only dig this out too high that way you don't have any endermen spawn down there on you because that would just be awful we're gonna add our let's see we need two spots we're gonna add our double chest there we're gonna have our hoppers all going into the double chest Now you want to add some slabs on top. You'll have to shift click, at least on that first one. And that should keep you nice and safe. Keep the stuff where it keeps, uh, keeps you safe. Um, and then if I remember correctly, I said we're going to dig the room, and I said we're going to dig over two. That's where we will put our ladder. A bit off there weren't we I'm not a good counter <laughs> uh, we're gonna throw a temporary block there uh, now this step you want to do sort of quickly not so much the water step but the uh, You will have to fight the water a bit when you get these two. I put that up too high, didn't I? Put it on your bottom one there. That's where I put it. Okay, yeah. Oh, that's right. Knock all this out. They're gonna come running. So you just gotta fight that water a little bit. And do not hit your endermite. As we saw, yeah, there they go already. And do not fall. I mean, it's not the end of the world if you fall in the portal, but. Oh, see, that's why I brought an extra train track, because I totally left that in there, and now it's gone. A way to make it even better, you can see what that does is it clears out everybody in a 64 block radius. But obviously, there's still guys over there. Uh, what you can do is anywhere that you have little side areas, um, you can add another endermite. So we'll do one of those just for fun. Oops. Look at that. Boom. But yeah, so definitely works. Definitely works. Makes you feel pretty powerful. Let's throw that down and we'll dump some. Now, 
If you're at level 0, this thing will get you to level 30 in about a minute, according to Chatman, and I have no reason to doubt those figures. You can see they just keep flooding right in. They're not going anywhere. Um, so we're going to need our train track. Our, uh, oh, we can go ahead and come up with a name for our new buddy. Um, I think my U-mate needs a friend. I'll have Mary mate. So, let's see. There's a lot of guys hanging out over there, and there's a lot hanging out over that way. So, this is where the whole ground leveling thing comes in. Obviously, these guys can't see because they're below, so you probably want to come in at some point if you really want this thing efficient. You want to come in at some point and uh, fix that up. So uh, they can see about 64 blocks. So I think we're going to put it on this high point right here is what we're going to do. Here's the funny part to this one. So we want him to come over here to visit Mary, but we don't want him to stay here. We want them to carry on on their journey. So what you do is you build a three by three. The idea is that they're supposed to see that mite and uh, come stand under here and then lose track of said mite. And uh, I should go get. Anyway, they're supposed to lose track of that mite, see the other mite. Oh, they're just trying to make me hit them, aren't they? keep right on moving along. That's the idea. We are going to go say hi. Um, we know that Enderman won't spawn down here, but we're going to go ahead and throw some torches. That'll make me feel warm and cozy. deep on this one. Keep your eyes pointed down, boys. Nothing to see here. Alright, so I just found Super Slacker 22's video on how to do this, and I guess she used the torch trick, which seems silly that a silk touch pick won't do it, but 
dropping it on a torch wheel apparently. So, uh, being careful not to hit all the Endermen running past you. Maybe do this first. Uh, you gotta dig down to right below, just like you would if you're farming sand or um, gravel, any kind of gravity block, throw a torch below it. Uh, supposedly, boom, yep, sure enough. Boom. That easy. Anyway, we'll just uh, top that off there. There we go. Yep, that still works. And we're home. Last place I slept. And it's nighttime. So. Oh, I think. Mm hmm. I don't know if you guys have been in here yet. But I think what we should do is make a special area. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm.